Kris Jenner and Kim Kardashian seem to be supporting Tristan Thompson and the LA Lakers. The momager, Kim, and her son, St. West, were spotted sitting courtside with Chris's boyfriend, Corey Gamble, for round one game four of the NBA playoffs between the LA Lakers and Memphis Grizzlies on Monday night. In a photo from the game, Chris was seen hugging Khloe Kardashian's ex, Tristan, who she shares her two children with, as he warmed up with his team. Kim wore leather pants and a leather jacket, while her mom rocked a purple pantsuit. Saint adorably wore an oversized jersey with Tristan's number on it. They weren't the only famous faces in the stands. Adam Sandler and Diddy were also in the crowd, along with Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, who were caught on the kiss cam. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex were all smiles as they appeared on the jumbotron. Meghan was seen giggling to her husband in a sweet clip shared by the NBA. The outing is Meghan's first physical public appearance since it was confirmed by Buckingham Palace that she will not be attending the coronation of King Charles on May 6. The mom of two is believed to be staying in California with their two children, Archie and Lilibet, to celebrate Archie's fourth birthday. Access Hollywood recently spoke to DailyMail.com's Charlie Langston, and she explained why she believes the Duchess of Sussex was likely relieved that the two milestones fell on the same day. Meghan is not attending the coronation for a number of reasons. Quite frankly, Archie's birthday provides her with the perfect excuse to stay behind at home. She can tell everyone that she wants to be with her son on his birthday, that she wants to make sure that he feels special and that he's able to celebrate it at home in California with his friends and loved ones. However, I think Meghan likely breathed a huge sigh of relief when they set the date for the coronation because who would want to travel to London and be around people who you know don't want you there. And that's the truth of the matter. It's better for everyone involved that Meghan does not attend. Whether or not she was planning on putting on a brave face, smiling for the cameras, acting as though things were all hunky-dory, the fact of the matter is her mere presence at the coronation would cause such a scandal, such a huge amount of public intrigue, that it would completely overshadow Charles and the rest of the senior royals.